So it's a bit uh, amateurish, I will admit, but uh, I have to show my phone for this video, and uh, I didn't want to like deal with cutting stuff and whatever. I'm also not that skilled of a video editor, but I wanted to show a video how this thing works. Um, it's nothing really crazy, but you know, it's easier than like looking at a README. But so you're looking at the Bank of America login, and uh, this is the script over here. Bofa.js is just uh, going to this site, waiting for this element here to be ready, and then uh, I can enter values from your credentials from the environment file. What do you want? Um, and then it like hits sign in, but then more than likely you'll get this two-factor thing. Actually, this is the regular login, but you'll get a two-factor thing, and then you have to get a text message. And then uh, this thing here. Oh god, he's in the way. Come on, move. I gotta move him. Come on. Hey, sit in the chair. Um. So you have to get the Foo Factor code from somewhere, and uh, I'm providing that manually through the Twilio app. Um. Uh, the in the current code line uh, 30 it says Twilio send SMS and I'll receive that a heads up that a two-factor auth message is coming and I'll receive that and I'll send it back I have a uh, VPS running the the Twilio uh, the Twilio two-factor API code over here that's the thing on the right side here and that uh, is what this code is hitting, the uh, auth looper script. That's just going over and over like every five seconds because the, the authentication codes have like a lifetime of 10 minutes. So the maximum is set to uh, 200, I think, or something like that, uh, 10 minutes. But yeah, I mean, it shouldn't take you that long. But so you get the uh, API running, and you call the script. I got my phone, um, and I have my Twilio number here. Um, oh crap! Get out of the way! Come on, move! Hey, uh. <clears throat> One take. Uh. So I just sent out the text telling me, like, right here, to factor request for BOFA. Get out of the way. Jesus. And then uh, BOFA will hit me in a minute. Stop. Lay down. Jesus. This video is ruined. Oh, there it is. Okay. So I have to take that code. Copy it. As I said, this is not an ideal way to do this, but I don't have any mobile apps developed right now. And then I send it back to my own API. Uh, like this. Uh, can't really see that, I guess. Anyway, so yeah, I send that. So now this uh, API, it's available. The script can continue with it. And then you can see the... Okay, you can't. The uh, spreadsheet updated with the balance from Bank of America, and then the script ends. So you pretty much have to write all of those for your own accounts, and some of them won't have two-factor off, so they'll be easier to deal with. <laughs> 